Hey guys, what's going on? It's your girl Vina Vias and I'm back with another video. So today I wanted to do a look that's gonna scream Happy Valentine's Day as Valentine's is right around the corner. And all the products that I'm using in this video to do this look are completely affordable. And if you're looking to get bombed and slayed on a budget, then keep on watching. Alright guys, so off camera I went ahead and filled in my brows. If you guys want to see how I go about filling my brows, um, I actually have a video that I made. So I'll leave um, th the link to that video in the description. But yeah, so I usually start off with my brows every time I do my makeup. And I've seen people do their foundation first, but that never works for me when I do eyeshadow. Let's begin. So I'm going to take this CNC concealer. And what this is, is a... Um, color corrector and I'm going to apply that to my entire lid with my finger. You want your eyeshadows to not crease, always use a base, okay? Now that I have my cream base, I'm gonna start with, hmm, honestly, I don't even know what colors I'm doing or what kind of look I'm doing, but it's gonna work. Guys, I really don't know what I'm about to do. I'm gonna play with it. I'm gonna take this zoo. I love this palette. It's so pretty. I'm gonna take this palette and I'm gonna use this color right here, this yellow. Okay, and I'm gonna use that as my top brow. What's this? The highlight eyelid. The high the highlight of my eyelid. <laughs> Exact palette. I'm gonna go in with the with this pink right here. In the same brush. I'm just gonna dab. Alright, so now that I have these two colors, and you see how it's giving it that little offset, like, sunset looky color? It works for me. Okay, so with the same exact brush. Uh, this is really difficult, guys. Um, I'm gonna go in with the purple, with this purple. And work it in the crease, okay? Crease 
Peace magic. God, like I told you, I don't really use shadows, but it never hurts to experiment. And I'm really focused on this, in this outer area. Is, uh, I don't know, it's not really kissy brush, but it's, it's look at the point of it. Shape of it is gonna really get me in that corner. Let me do that. Let me do that in my crease i don't know if it was recording all the time because the camera just turned off out of nowhere so hopefully it was recording i hope it didn't stop but i'm using the same correction color to um do this the color corrector that i used earlier for my leg to just literally cut this crease but it's not moving as much. So what I'm gonna do is take a little bit of um, my concealer and push it in there a little bit. Go ahead and use this pretty rose gold color you know and this is like something that's like skin friendly for dark skin girls you know if you don't want to go too bright this has that shimmer of gold that looks beautiful on chocolate skin and that hint of pink that we are always looking for so yeah i'm gonna try it out actually i never tried this but just looking at it i can see the effect that look look at look at how pigmented it is this I feel like I need a little bit more purple on this side I have more purple here that I don't want this side so I'm just gonna go on with a little bit more purple hey right, guys I'm gonna have to go apply my lashes off um camera because I gotta go to the bathroom and put them on it's too hard for me to do it this way and I'm gonna be right back y'all putting on my lashes was a real struggle I think I messed it up right here but 
still do. It's okay. I just can't get it all right. I don't know what happened, but you know, I ended up pulling a piece out. <laughs> so, oh, I got glue on my real lashes. Lashes are really a struggle. Comment below if you struggle with your lashes. Oh God, this piece of I'm just feathering them up. So now for some eyeliner, and this eyeliner is by Ruby Kisses. I got this for a dollar. Alright guys, so off camera, I'm going to go apply my foundation. If you guys want to see how I apply my foundation, I actually did a video on this, so I will tag that video down below. But yeah, so foundation, highlight, all that is in that video. So if you do want to see how I got this flow, looking like this, the link will be down below. So instead of highlighting with my usual highlight, I'm going to highlight with the palette. I think that would be dope, right? Um, I can't contour with any of these colors just because um, this brown is really close to my skin. I don't think it will be, it will have any kind of effect. I might use it as a little bit of a blush on top of my contour that I apply, but I'm gonna go ahead and highlight with the base coat that I use on my lips. Take a little bit because, as y'all already see, this palette is highly pigmented. Oh, that looks good. Look at it. I'm definitely gonna have to con. Oh, oh, yeah, girl. Yeah, who's that peeking through my window? It's Everything. Okay. Is this a two or a two? That's a two. If you say don't, you're a hater. Like this video just because that highlighted did that, all right? That was cute. It, ooh. Miss Vina. Yes. All right. Down to my lips. Let me do my lips. Let me do my lips. I'm just feeling this as a highlight. I can't believe it. Wow, wow, oh my God. I gotta show y'all this without the ring light and just natural light and what it look like cause this is real, real cute. All right, so with lipsticks and stuff, I always start off with a dark brown coat. Oh, this is black, I would've painted. Out of the nine colors, I use one, two, three, four, five. So I use all these colors except for that middle row, okay? And I think I missed it, but I use this to just contour my nose. I'll just do it again for you guys. I mean, I think that's pretty dope. And because it's on a brighter arm, like, burnt orange side like I said it's not as dark um, I'm just going to take whatever product is left over from my foundation powder actually I'll just use this one it's 
because I have the purple it might make the purple pop a little uh, what color is this this is vivid violet so yeah let me try this out I'm gonna put this up and my camera is dying again but it should hold it's not completely dead but let me use this I'm gonna try it I feel like this color is very comparable to that MAC lipstick, uh, what is it called, heroin? Yeah, the MAC lipstick heroin. It has the same exact color. I will insert a picture because I used that before. I have a picture on Instagram that looks just, um, that I actually used that lipstick. But, um, I like the color, guys. I really do. Alright, guys, so this is the final look. What do you guys think about it? Make sure you guys comment below. Yeah, I honestly think this is pretty cute. Even in my bonnet, I'm looking like, hey, you a little snack, guys. <laughs> I think this is cute. So, if you guys really like this look, you, you know, I was trying to shoot for something that wasn't the ordinary pink that people try to do on Valentine's Day. Something that's still on the bright, cute, pink, purpley side, but more on a calm, collective type of vibe. Alright guys, so I totally forgot to do my under eye. Yeah. So I'm gonna go in back with this um, this brush and I'm gonna take um, the purple that I had in the outer corner and just smudge it underneath my line. Sorry for the noise in the back guys as I and groove. Okay, baby, can you pass me my black pencil too? My number two pencil. <laughs> I'm gonna go in with this. This is a little thinner. I might be able to smudge it a little better. See, I'm going back with it. This might work better. Alright, so I'm gonna be using Kids by New York. I actually think they did a remake. And make them Shayla came up with a line. And I think it was the same exact one, but I'm not sure. But this mascara, this mascara is the I Envy Bold and Long. So I'm gonna use that on my lower lashes. what you guys think i think it came out pretty cute i used 
this whole palette basically to do my whole face. So this, pal this palette comes with nine colors and out of the nine colors, I used five of them. So literally all you need was about $10 to get a palette that will fulfill this display effect. Okay. Well, if you guys enjoyed watching this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to our channel if you have not done so. And leave your comments behind if you think there was something that I could do differently, which you want me to expand on. I'll be happy to address it in the comment section. And if you're not following me on Instagram or Twitter, you can tweet me or follow me on Instagram at Vina underscore Via. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll tune in later. Alright guys, so I took my hair out of the bonnet and this is the final look. Honey, I think I look. I think I look cute. Um guys, also I know y'all been requesting um the hair tutorial videos or the information about how to retain the length and all that. This here is two years in process okay meaning my last perm was in march of 2016 so i'm about to reach my three-year anniversary but look at this all this natural hair growth giving life yes if y'all want to see the video and learn these tips comment below and let me know i'll drop that as soon as i get 25 likes on this video i will drop the hair secrets video enjoy your valentine's day this sun coming through the window though is real it's definitely real all right bye <laughs>